Welcome back, everybody, to Farming Simulator 17 here on Oregon Spring 17. Y'all getting uh, tired of hearing that? Oregon Spring 17? Huh? Well, folks, it's your host with the most, or is it? Tommy Miller, aka Mr. Blue. Folks, we got to deliver some logs. I don't know why I get in on the right side for it. We're not supposed to be getting in on the left. But we are not taking these to the lumber mill. Well, we're not taking it to the train station, put it that way. It's train station's up north. We're actually going to pull in right here. Because our pallet factory is getting kind of low. Now, I need to do the math on this, really. Because I don't know which one pays out the most. We could be losing a lot of money as far as I'm concerned. Uh, I, I, I really don't know how to do this. Uh, I guess I need to find out how many liters that's in, that this holds. Let's see if I can just drive across here. Well, maybe if I didn't hit that. No. Alright, left side. Uh, yep, left side. Unload the X button. There it goes. Whoa, 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 whoa. Pick them back up. We sure didn't need that many. Much this thing holds anyway. Forty-seven thousand. Oh, I don't hold very much. So I guess each pallet holds four thousand. I guess I really need to wait and see when this thing gets down to four thousand liters to see how much is on a pallet from four thousand logs. But what it does is it, it makes the planks and it grinds up the sawdust from them so we get several things Ooh, I better lock these down I guess since we already got them loaded and that thing's full we'll go ahead and send these off now folks if you haven't noticed anything different in the top right corner we are running season mod now that's right let me get it pulled up here look at there Early spring ain't nothing but rain, rain, rain. And let me get this guy going here and we'll see if we can plant yet. No, we need to do some field work. Uh, let's see here. Let's go here. Transport. We're going to go wood to wood. Which wood is the wood? I mean the wood. Nearest point. I uh, gotta get that on that and drive course. And uh, he's good for. Um, let's go into our seasons. It's showing we can plant now, but look at our temperature. Our temperature is down. It needs to be blue. So uh, we can plant grass right now, but I don't want no grass. I'm planning on buying field two if any way possible. And it'll be a time to plant potatoes and sugar beets also. Which I'm planning on doing. Um we're gonna need a little corn, a little soybeans. Um and mostly probably barley. Is what we'll plant. So, uh, probably sugar beets is what we'll plant and barley. But we gotta get the temperature up. So, right now, let's see what temp was that. They don't say, does it? Just say five degrees Celsius. This is supposed to be in. We want Fahrenheit. On, on, on. 
show tracks. I can't get that for some reason to show tracks. Snow tracks. Maybe because there ain't no snow right now. Snow mod, one layer only. Ah, oh, there we go. Snow mode on. Snow tracks is on. In nine days. Okay, on, on, Fahrenheit. Nine days, and all these are on. Apply settings. Okay. Uh, all that is still good. Sugar beets, potatoes. Okay. Okay, they're all good. Still got the rain. Uh, wait. What was that in Fahrenheit, though? 41 degrees Fahrenheit where it needs to be our ground temperature is Fahrenheit for our top thing let me fast forward time here a little bit because right now we're 6 a.m. starting out and around here folks it's usually not this bright at 6 a.m. so I'm going to go ahead and stop driver close that out now I wish this was a little bit better thought about because well I guess I can go in and circle around like this and I could make the pause right there but I would still have to back up but I don't mind backing up All right, uh, X. Oh, yeah, make me that money. Get me out of debt. That's what I'm talking about, folks. All right, I'm going to leave this truck. Well, actually, I'm going to let this truck go back to, uh, it's got to hit wood to wood. Okay, so I said you're going to click it. Uh, nearest waypoint, drive court, nope, 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 gotta get out of here. Gotta get right there, drive course. What are you doing? I don't know why it's wanting to turn around. Maybe because I clicked it too soon. Now let's just let it do that. Uh, let's see here. We gotta we gotta finish up this guy real quick. Can't remember who was driving it last. Uh, done an awesome job to go over here uh, with my help of course we do a UE now with this disc we're not supposed to turn around with it on the ground oh now it reaches its waiting point now let's, let's take this real quick folks uh, continue Stop at the last trigger. There we go. And close that out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, man. My bad. Not gotta quit doing that. Turn back and up a little bit down in the ground. Real life, it would tear all those games off. Alright, chicken has been born. Oh, by the way, I did buy some extra chickens. We are at my minimum number now, 300. You know, like, minimum. And I'm like, yeah, folks, minimum. Alright, that's probably going to be all. So, let's get rid of that for right now. We're going to 
trying to overlap just a little bit because make sure it gets this down here. Alright. Whoa, 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 gotta put the disc down. Put the disc down. There we go. Now take off. And square and higher work. Where did my truck go? Let's check on one truck real quick. Oh, okay. There it goes. All right, it should turn around pretty good. Um, gotta fill this up and uh, gotta fill our truck and truck or trailer up back here. And I can't remember, I think we sprayed them to a so if that's the case, we gotta get this board going. Maybe I need the Cultivate Den Spray. I, I really can't remember. I'm gonna sneak across the road here and go around this way. Can't wait to get that filled. We'll have a bunch more uh, ground to do. Unfold. It looks like we can spray. I'm not for sure. I bet we can. I bet we have to cultivate. Yeah, we're going to have to cultivate. That's no biggie. I'm going to stop right here. I don't want to get in his field too, too much. Let's go ahead and go stop this guy. It's going to get this blue right now. Stop driver. Well, we're going to leave that. But, um. Yeah, I almost got this section knocked out. And, um. Uh, th this for uh, everybody's information and stuff. What plans are. Um. Going to plow. Plow this up and turn it into a grass field. And uh, then I'm going to continue on this block right here, cutting trees. But that block right there, I will plant trees back in its place so we'll have extra trees. Might even plant some on this in here. Who knows? But that's the outcome on that. Um, while he's doing that, we need to get this guy here. Uh, Jason Collin, Mr. Yankee, greets they all up. And if you're all not mistaken, this is the 9RT, the 9560. Uh, got wider tracks, 560 horsepower, I believe. And we gotta be careful. Hey, chicken been born. Now that's what I'm talking about. Cause I've been fast forwarding time too. And uh, the temperature's done warm up. I'm gonna fast forward to about maybe 11 o'clock when that sun gets out real good. We can uh get some good stuff going on. All right, I'm gonna lower that down. Now, if I'm not mistaken, right, or mistaken, wrongly, you can see the front is not changing, but it's taking away the cover, the fertilization, and you see the back is smoothing it out. So, let me get in this turn right here, and I'll show y'all. I can hit LB and Y, and you see right there, it'll make a feel. So hit Y again, it'll take it away. And uh, you see, I can get over right there. It's not really messing with it. 
Boy, that thing's throwing up some dirt. I'm going to go around the edges. But it's still a disc, but it's got that higher basket on the back that smooths things out. They do make these in real life, but around here in my area, in, in Arkansas, state of Arkansas, they use field cultivators. Uh, not the kind that goes down between row crops, like cotton or beans or something. But it's, it's, it's something like this, but it's got plows on it instead of uh, disc blades. And uh, they it does help break the quads and stuff down better. And this guy moved nine mile an hour, but it seems like he's flying. I'm glad we got the nine RT. Uh, we'll probably get one of the big swivel type tractors, but we'll probably start small, which ain't small, but like the big bud. Uh, after or harvest season uh, this coming year. All right, it's 11 o'clock, so I'm gonna sh slow the time down. I'm gonna have to go feed the uh, the chickens here pretty soon. I'm gonna do all the way around this, around the border, outline edges, and then I'll probably just hire a worker. Then come back and get what he misses, which hopefully ain't very much. And I hope I can hire a worker with this. Yes, I can hire a worker. Yay. And then, um,. Wow, it's 17 minutes in already. Folks, it just seems like I can't get that done. I just, what, we went and sold a load of logs? And that was pretty much it. Which we got nobody working on Phil Ford. They done quit. I, don't, I didn't even check to see who it was. Y'all check to see who it was? Um, folks, people that's uh, names pop up on my hired workers, uh, most of them are down below in the description. And if they're not down there, that means they uh, don't have a YouTube channel. Which they probably have a YouTube channel. Everybody's got a YouTube channel if they got Google. Um, but they probably just don't have, they don't make videos. They just watch. That's a guy I gotta Jay, say, uh, Jason and Donna and them, uh, they really watch my videos and stuff for me, so it helps out. Now this one big field now. And just think how big it'd be if I had that. Which that should be my next field, but I think I'm gonna shoot for a two. Which up at the very top corner up there. I'm either gonna shoot for two or sixteen. Or 22. Reason for those have grass. I need some grass for my sheep. Which is the next animal I'm getting. It's going to be sheep. Alright. I need to figure out what I'm going to do. What kind of angle I'm going to take. I think I got enough turnaround room. See right there where it left the prow mark? That's the only thing I hate about this, but 
got to do what you got to do, right? Okay, I think I'm going to go this way. So, GPS time. Get everything set up. Uh, Whip. 10, 9. I want to take that down some. What does the store say this thing is? Go on the cover. Sorry, folks. That's what we usually do. And, and uh, just to show you. This is what a field cultivator kind of looks like. Well, this is, would pass for a chisel plow. Yeah, and that's chisel plow. And a field cultivator would be something like this here. It's got the little miniature plow, wide plows on it. Uh, is that what we got? Nope. that in there so it is 12 meters wide okay so let's do the auto it's showing 10-9 there we'll just dot down to an 8 and uh, we're going to get rid of that Okay. Let's go to town. Woo, look at that dust. That would probably be... Let me stop here. Get a good... There we go. Screenshot. And what I usually do is when I take that screenshot, I'll just zoom in, uh, get all these boxes and stuff out of it. All right, what I'm going to do is work this uh, part right here out, and then I'm going to zoom in. And usually on these dishes, when I say about turn around a bit in the ground, I usually raise it up where maybe just a half an inch, just enough to cover your tracks. Is what I usually do when I'm working. When I used to work, I didn't say that. When I used to work, I would still turn around with it in the ground, but it'd be just barely in the ground that way to cover all your tracks and stuff from the tractor this does pretty good I just hate that little bit that does leave you see it right there on the right it leaves quite a bit when you turn around like that but then again all of them does All right, and that uh, was just me hitting the GPS, and I let off the, the Xbox controller long enough to hit the three on the keyboard for uh, cruise speed. But we only got just a little bit here, folks, and then we'll hire a worker, and then we'll go get our planner ready. Uh, we got about six minutes left. We need to check the fertilization on this too. Sometimes plowing takes that fertilization to the next step. Uh, I'm gonna wait a little bit about spraying. We'll get our planter and stuff going. I was gonna put the planter on this and but uh I don't know we might here a minute it won't take but a minute to swap them out but I'm going to go ahead and get it filled up and stuff with the other tractor 
I need to put seeds and stuff in it. Alright, I'm gonna get straight here and hire a worker. Oh, oh. Always, always. I'll turn that off. Then hire a worker. Alright, doing pretty good. Go ahead and get over here. Jump the fence. Jump the fence. Oh. As you can see, we got a small planter here, which we might take back. I don't know. We're playing lease on this baby here, so we need to get it working. Uh. Oh wow. Oh, I got a. Where, this guy's. 4,000. Let me move this off real quick so I'll be making. Where's my hand? Oh. Yeah. There we go. Alright, where'd my hand go? Now I know this ain't realistic. I shouldn't be doing it. But I got four on the truck. Got two stacked up here. So four, five, six, seven, truck only holds six. So uh but this thing will start here in a minute. There we go. Let's see here. This is up, it's gonna start. I don't know who was working, but they just left it here. And it looks like the end's been got, so that's good. I thought this guy was free, or this person was free, but they're not, so... I don't know what I'm going to do. Uh, let's see here. We're going to drive until we get straight. And folks, I got a video clip I forgot. Uh, it's only two minutes long. It shows the loads I was doing. Uh, I think four loads that I took over to the hay barn to sell the bales of hay uh, off this field. I just thought about that. It's, uh, I think I had five loads total, I'm not for sure, but it shows four of those loads that I took, that I know of. So, uh, let's see, I'm going to hire a worker here. If I had to go across this again here, what it looks. But yeah, I'm going to insert that video right now.
All right, folks, what do y'all think about that? Made a little bit of money off of that. But I totally forgot about the uh, video clip. Let's see. See this nugget? No, no. Right there. He's done turning around. So he's doing good. Um, let's get this guy off this field. We need to check the fertilization first before we do anything. Um, let's see. Let's zoom in. Don't look like it was doing anything, so uh, we uh, got to spray it in. And as far as on the growth, you can see right there where that's done being uh, the light greenish here is a uh, cloud. And the where it's blue, it's been cultivated. You can see the legends over here, but anyway, uh, we got a spray, so I'm just going to do up to right there for now. We're just going to give us a, a GPS uh, going on here. So, what we're spraying is not going to hurt the other farmer. Yeah, this uh, boost. Get my wings up here. I like them a little high in case I fall in a dip. We're going to retract our GPS on this instead of what we had. Make sure we're auto correct on the size. Now just hit me. Yeah, there we go. Got a little spray in the do. Let's uh, turn that just a little since we're doing diagonal. That should work right there. Alright, let's get busy. Like I said, that's not going to hurt Farmer John over there. Would have spraying some Miracle Grow. Well, a lot of people like Miracle Grow. Uh, used to spray. Oh, man. I used to spray Echo, Echo Boost, or something like that, and it was uh, pretty much this uh, Equate version of Miracle Girl. And a lot of people are like, "Why are you spraying that?" And I told them to make the weeds grow, and they're like, "What?" But really, that's what I was doing was making the weeds grow but the tank that was the front tank of, on my tractor the back tank was roundup and the people was like okay so you're spraying miracle girl and roundup at the same time I'm like yes ma'am yes sir the, what it was the miracle girl was half the dose it wasn't a full dose what it should be you know like you say it calls for 10 ounces we only put five ounces and what that done was it would make i don't sit here i gotta do something on the other computer real quick uh, getting a lot of pop-ups and the software that i'm making money on uh, don't like pop-ups it's wanting a full video I was gonna stop right there and I didn't I'm gonna do it right there but uh anyway this the earner B I was telling y'all about in the other video uh, anything pops up in front of it it pauses the game so uh yeah um, pull a nurse trailer up under this thing here, and we're gonna fill up. And I'm gonna, yeah, and fill it back. We'll fill up both of them. Just have to turn the pump on, circulate it. Eh, 
close enough right there. Get that filling up. Uh, I think I'm going to leave the 6R on the rake and baler because we need uh, to rake some grass somewhere. Uh, might be episode or two down the road. Uh, I'm going to show y'all. Oh, yeah. I'll put the uh, Brent in here. We'll close the door. And uh, I need a tractor. All of them's busy that I got. Except for a little red. Borrow him. Uh, well, I'll unhook that. Now, red can't pull this thing when it's out in the field, but it can pull it over there and put some seeds in it or see what kind of seeds we need. Uh, fertilizer is pretty much full. Uh, now, chicken been born. Oh, we're going in negatives. I'm like, look at that money going up. That's actually negatives. All right, I should have moved that trailer. All right, should be pretty good. Um, make sure I got room. Yeah, I got room here. We're going to get these pallets right here and fill this thing up. So, hmm. All right, he's done his job. I still feeling. Let's see, that's filling that up with water. We need to check the chickens out, because I'm pretty sure they're going to eat some water and straw by now. Uh, it's 35 minutes in. Wow. Let me go ahead and get this filled up with water. We'll grab a straw bale. We're going to have to get a nurse tank up here. It's just getting ridiculous how these chickens are. But we, whoa. Well, that's one way of getting it established. Come on out here so I can get you. Hey, is this auto... No, this ain't the auto bell loader. Almost hit that post. That was a good nudge. What do y'all think? Oh, oh, I'm down too low. I'm on now. Let's stick it this way. There we go. Just enough to get it over to where I need to go. Nah. How many of y'all laughing right now? I bet you quite a bit. I'm going to try it again. Let's go, go. Who left the gate open? Jason, you leave this gate open. I bet you did. All right. I haven't had a chance to fix this yet. But it's right in here somewhere. And this water, you have to be out here. And the first icon you get, as soon as the wheel passes that marker, and it's right there. All right, let's see if we can get this in here. It's right here. Is this really, really sensitive? Let me check, make sure it needs it. Oh, it don't need it. Wow. Okay, so straw is down, but all our other stuff is full. Uh, less than two hours, we'll have another chicken. We got 
that made eight so far. So I'm going to sell one chicken and see what it costs. All right, we're going to sell one. So $46 to sell one. And a hundred and eighteen dollars no a hundred dollars to buy one Ooh. okay so we sell one it's eighteen dollars so we had an ammo truck to take it to the dealer we could save eighteen dollars so that would help so cool well folks I guess I'm gonna end the episode right here and um, it didn't take all the water, so I'm just going to leave the tractor sitting here, but I'm going to close this gate. Well, folks, I'm glad each and every one of y'all uh, watching and commenting and showing love and stuff. I appreciate it. Don't know how much it means to me. But I got to get off here, so y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all later.